So next we're doing the CBC Amber Vice, probably one of the greatest examples of this style of beer mm -hmm. in the world. Um, the amber is just because of the color and, and how much the sort of uh, malt is, is roasted. A Vice beer is a wheat beer. It's not completely wheat, obviously there's barley and there's wheat in it, um, but it is very popular in Germany um, and Belgium. And um, Vice is the German style of it. Wit is the Belgian style of it, and wheat should theoretically be what we call right. in South Africa. So there are subtle differences in the brewing process, but uh, this is, as I said, probably in the world one of the best examples of an amber um, vice. So you'll see the difference in color immediately. Wow, it's much darker. Yeah, much more sort of golden, and an amber again, it's the terms in brewing are, are very loosely thrown mm -hmm. around. Mm -hmm. You know, you can call something amber that doesn't have an amber color. Although there are style guidelines which you sort of hold up a, a color chart right. and it says it should look something like this. But if it doesn't, it doesn't mean you haven't made that style mm -hmm. of beer. So again, very nice head. Um, obviously not as clear as the previous ones right. because it's a Hefeweizen, which means that there's still some yeast floating around in it. Although this beer does also get filtered and pasteurized. Um, on the nose a lot sweeter. Way sweeter than the last one. Um, and you should get sort of, you should get a, uh, it's, it's a banana-y sort of uh, nose coming off that. And then when you taste it, there's two unique flavors, which mm. I don't really want to tell you, see if you can <laughs> experience it for yourself. What do you get there? I can taste the unique flavor, but I don't know what it is. It's cloves. Cloves? Yeah. I would have never guessed that. So you should get cloves, you should get bubble gum, you should get banana. And as I said, those are from the esters and the phenols, which are caused from the reactions. And um, this one, because it's an amber vice and it's slightly sweeter because of that caramelization of, mm. the, of, of the malt. If you had this um, in the old style that Wolfgang used to make it. Mm -hmm. You really, really got that like red um, sort of roasted flavor and the, the bananas and the, and the mm. cloves. And that gave you a real bubblegum flavor. I can definitely smell the bubblegum, but I can't taste it. Either oh. way, it's, a, it's an unbelievable it beer. <laughs> At the Festival of Beer for two years in a row, mm. out of 200 odd beers, this is one best beer on show twice, wow. um, which is saying something. And it also says a lot for his consistency yeah. that he's constantly brewing it. 